in her, throw up the sex in her. What's up, guys? It's your girl Adira. If you are new here, welcome. And if you are a returning watcher or subscriber, welcome back. So, I'm sure as you can see by the title, I'm just gonna be filming a few days in my life. I think this is probably only gonna be like two to three days max. I just uploaded a collective vlog not too long ago. I just, I have a few things going on this week that I would love to record and get some content out of. Today is currently Wednesday, July 5th. Yesterday was July 4th. I started vlogging yesterday, but the footage just, nothing went how it was supposed to go yesterday. So I'm like, we're just gonna scrap that and we're just gonna start completely over. It is currently 9.20 a.m. I've actually been up since 7 a.m. Had to take my little brother to camp and it's just hard for me to go back to sleep. So I'm like, I'm just gonna stay up. For today's agenda, I actually plan on working out this morning. I used to work out consistently like every single day, like from the comfort of my home, but then I just stopped. Especially when school starts back up, I always start working out less because I be having way too much going on throughout the school year. But since I'm on summer break, I'm going to try to start to become a little bit more consistent with my fitness. Honestly, I work out from the comfort of my home and it's just fine. I get the results that I'm looking for. For a really long time now, I've been thinking about getting me like a gym membership or something like that. But I just be hearing too much bad things about like women being like sexualized in the gym and just feeling unsafe in the gym and being followed home into your car and into the bathroom and I just I don't have time for that like just being a woman is already like a safety risk within itself so it's just like I really want to join the gym but I don't have time for that and then a little bit later today I do plan to take myself out to lunch because there is this Mexican spot that I've been wanting to try and they have burrito tacos and I really hope it's good because I love me a good burrito taco but I don't get to eat them often because most of the places that sell burrito tacos at least in Indianapolis are either in a not so good area or they're just really far from me so I found a place that's like 20 minutes which isn't bad and I'm very familiar with the area that it's in I frequent that area all the time so I'm gonna take myself out to lunch a little bit later today and I'm really geeked for that and then I think I may or may not stop at Target it just kind of depends because I'm in the process of redecorating my room and I feel like once you start the decorating process it's just so 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 addicting I'm gonna go ahead and get my workout started so that because honestly I might lay back down after I work out I don't know I'm kind of tired but let's get into the outfit even though I'm working out from home I still like to be cute so I just have on like this sports bra and then I have on these leggings um and the detailing on them is so cute like it goes all the way down and I just love the color like this burnt orange is really giving these are from forever 21 they have a really good active wear line I feel like people sleep on their active wear but I have so much like cute active sets and stuff like that from them <laughs> my workout and I actually feel somewhat energized I just did a 20 minute workout I want to take it like slow since I'm just now starting back up I did this ab workout that I used to do it's like a 10 minute ab workout and I can link it somewhere I don't know maybe I'll just put like a picture of it because free promo it's kind of crazy but um yeah so i just finished my workout i did like this 10 minute ab workout and every time i stick to it and be consistent with it i always see results so that's what i'm going to be doing for the next couple of weeks once i finished up with her ab routine i basically just kind of did my own thing because i have my own weights and resistance bands so i just kind of did like my own thing and then i like to lift weights just so i could gain a little bit more muscle in my arms so i did that for the other 10 minutes so first 10 minutes was ab focused and then the other 10 minutes was just kind of like freestyle just kind of like whatever i wanted to do basically and then we also have a treadmill here at my house um normally normally i hit the treadmill but i just did not feel like doing cardio today so i may do cardio tomorrow i'm not really sure but 
yeah that was today's little plan and i feel so good like i'm so proud of myself that i actually took the initiative to start because once i start i'm pretty consistent i also made sure that i recorded like my workout on my watch because i just feel like that's a good way for me to keep track of the last time i worked out how long i worked out how many calories i burned my heart rate and all that good stuff so honestly i'm just about to take a quick shower and then i'm just gonna kind of like chill out until i get hungry i guess because like i said i'm gonna take myself to lunch and i ate breakfast around like eight something so i'll probably say maybe around like 11 11 30 12 ish i'll probably start getting hungry child whenever my stomach start growling is when i'll start getting ready to go eat hey guys so it's a little bit later it's now 1209 and i'm up i definitely did take me a little nap but i feel like that's okay because honestly what else was there for me to do besides go back to bed because I wanna, I'm getting lunch and the restaurant just opened at 11 so they've only been open for like a full hour so I really wasn't missing anything but it didn't take me long to get ready like at all because if I'm being 100% honest I had this complete outfit on yesterday but I'm wearing it again because nothing went as planned yesterday like if I'm being honest I didn't even end up going anywhere <laughs> yesterday like I stayed in the house like all yesterday like i put my clothes on and then we left the house and then we ended up coming right back home so i'm wearing this outfit again i already posted pictures in it because i'm like since i'm already wearing it i might as well take my pictures because i had people to take my pictures but i didn't get to go anywhere so now that i'm actually going anywhere i'm like okay i'm gonna wear this again ignore the unmade bed it was made when i first started the video but since i got back in the bed it's not but i just have on like this cute little black dress it has like these cute little cutouts on the side and then like the whole back is kind of out and then i'm just wearing my birkenstocks they're like this croc print and then i just have like this little shoulder bag from forever 21 this is from Shein. you will be seeing this in my summer haul here's how it looks like in closer detail like has like lines and stuff going down there but i just think it's so cute and classy i'm very modest so i love stuff like this i'm gonna take my cup so that i could have something to drink like on the way there and on the way back because like depending on how i feel i may stop at target but it also it just depends on like how long i'm at this restaurant oh so it just kind of depends but and then i have some more plans later on this week but we're just gonna take it one day at a time Persian rocks. But she's from the group I thought she was Persian love Are we turning up or are we wasting time? Girl, don't waste my time, you know I'm party alone Just wanna chill with you so i'm at target now and i didn't vlog on my way well actually target is literally like two minutes from where i was just at so it really wasn't anything to vlog but i ended up getting on the phone towards the end so i didn't even really vlog much towards the end but i'm about to go into target and see what they have because child, i'm just in a shopping mood i don't know So we're back in the house back from target i'm gonna show you guys what i got really quickly i'm filming two videos this days in my life video and then i'm doing a revamp my room with me video so i just went into like full depth of everything that i got from my room and i don't feel like doing that again if you want the deets detail details about the stuff in my room you're gonna have to check out the revamp my room video when that drops I'm not sure when that's happening because it's a process but i got this little stand to go in the corner of my room don't know when this is going to get put up because everybody's so busy around here and i don't think i'm capable of doing that by myself and then i just got this little picture frame to put my grandmother's picture in her pictures are already in the frame but they're broken both of her picture frames broke and i just got this cute little plant to put on that shelf that i just bought because it's just so cute and it was literally five dollars next up just got me some more deodorant because i'm almost out the degree ultra clear and i just got some mouthwash because i only have a couple of swigs left and what's that one mouthwash that everybody be using therabreath yeah therabreath i tried that out like almost about a year ago i'm just not a fan 
and I'm not afraid to say that. Like, just because something's trending don't mean I'm going to just use it just because it's trending. I just stick to Listerine. Honestly, I don't think I'm going to be doing anything else for the rest of the day. Good morning, guys. It is a few days later. It hasn't been that long, but I was supposed to do pottery, like, on Friday. Just been so tired. I've been having, like, insomnia. But anyways, I'm about to go ahead and get ready and head to pottery. You can just walk in and, like, start painting. So it's not like I have an appointment or, like, I'm on a fixed time frame. So that's really good. I'll talk to you guys a little bit more um when i'm in the car because they open at 11 and i'm filming on my phone so let me get my ipad <laughs> to see what time it is but okay so yeah it's 10 25 and they open at 11 and it's about 20 minutes away i know exactly where it is because it's like in this strip mall that i go to all the time but anyways let me quit playing and get my room together because child we looking a little we looking a little messy in here this morning getting ready i ended up just putting my hair in like a claw clip because i just wasn't really feeling my hair and i don't have time to deal with it today but as far as my outfit i just have on like this little frilly tank top and these mom jeans and then i wore my white converse today normally i'd wear like sandals with an outfit like this but child i'm not really in the mood for sandals and then i just have my purse and then I have this tote bag that I got from my school because um, I'm bringing my iPad so that I can look on Pinterest for like painting ideas. And then I need my tripod for my camera and I just have like my AirPods and like a snack and stuff in here. So yeah, I don't normally carry two bags when I go places, but yeah, that's why. And then for my set of the day, I'm just gonna do Burberry Her. I don't know if it's me that looks weird, or if it's the camera quality <laughs> that looks weird but i feel like i'm unusually closer to the camera than what i normally am it's just like not a good hair day for me and when i'm having like a bad hair day i feel like everything looks bad <laughs> i saw like this crazy tiktok and it said we just need to face the facts that a bad makeup day is worse than a bad hair day and i just don't see that because if i'm having a bad makeup day trust i'm going to wipe all of that stuff off and go on about my day and i feel like it's so hard to fix a bad hair day as a girl the only way to fix a bad hair day is like put it in a ponytail or wash it and you know as a black girl like we can't just hop in the shower and wash our hair and be done like that wash day is a whole thing within itself like if you do your hair at home then it's a whole day if you go to a hairstylist then it's just a few hours but child my mom does my real hair so it be it takes the whole day but yeah i'm on my way to pottery and i am so excited because first of all i love doing things that allow me to express my creativity like drawing writing painting and stuff like that and i feel like this summer i haven't really done anything that allows me to tap into my hobbies I've been so focused on like working that i haven't really taken any time out to just like do fun things like last summer i didn't have a job but i did so much that catered to like my hobbies i went to the park a lot i bought a bunch of books i read i drew i painted i colored like i had such a peaceful relaxing hobby filled summer last summer but this summer has just been kind of like miserable like can't even lie before school starts back up because child once college starts back up for me i don't have a life outside of school that's really sad to say but it's the truth because 
school just takes up all of my time so I'm just trying to enjoy the last couple of moments of my summer before I go back to school. I mean, it's only like, what, July 10th? I don't go back till August 21st, but as a college student, you know summer break flies by so fast. This isn't like my first time doing pottery. Um, I used to go all the time with my mom when I was younger, not to the same place. I don't even think the place we went to was open anymore. But I used to do pottery with my mom all the time. Like I did a vase one time, a coffee cup, a plate, like a little saucer. My mom did a whole bunch of stuff too, but I don't even think she has hers anymore. If she does, I have no idea where it is. But um, And then I went to do pottery on like a field trip with my school. That's actually how we got into pottery because I'm like, I had so much fun on my little field trip and like we should go back there. So that's how we got into it. But I'm going to this different place. I see it all the time because like I said, I shop in the strip mall that the pottery place is in. So hopefully it's like cool and chill because I don't have time for no like hostile environment. I'm like 10 minutes away. So I'm just gonna like listen to my music and like chill. And then I'll pick the camera back up when I get there. like after they put it in the little kiln thingy and like make it glossy and stuff because it always looks really different after that but now I'm going home because I am so hungry like I had Duncan but it didn't fill me up for some reason so I'm gonna go home and eat and I'm really gonna chill I'm actually kind of tired because like I said I haven't been getting sleep so I'll talk to you guys later quick little update like i've been home for probably like 20 minutes i didn't even realize that my amazon package was outside normally they send like notifications like to our phones because me and my family we share amazon prime so like normally they send pictures pictures normally they send notifications to our phone well they leave pictures too but i didn't get anything so i'm thinking it's not gonna get here till later but it's been outside evidently 
I just ordered like some cute little accessories for my car. And I'm just excited because child, I love adding like cute little stuff to my car. I wanna get like a Squishmallow and like stick it on my dashboard. It's gonna be so cute. But I ordered this cute little thing <laughs> to go on my mirror. First of all, it's Hello Kitty. Like if this isn't so freaking adorable, hello. I know it can be used for like multiple things. Like some people use it as a keychain and like put on their backpack, but it's for like your mirror in your car. Like, oh my God, look at her. Like, look, ooh. And then the only other thing I ordered for my car, I ordered these coasters. I already have coasters in my car, but I wanted to replace them. They're like black with glitter, but child, I don't want black. So I ordered these, so cute. It comes with four, so you can like switch them out. But um, most people were doing like the pink together or like the yellow together, but I think it's cute mitch match so i honestly think i'm probably gonna do should i do these two i don't know the tiger's kind of cute i mean i can always switch it out it really doesn't matter but smiley face or tongue out since okay i'm gonna do the lightning bolt and the tongue oh it's gonna be so cute right. hey guys it is now what's today thursday and and i just picked up my pottery so it's like ready so I can actually see like what it looks like now that it's finished but I'm about to get back in my car so I'll show you guys in a second okay so yeah I'm back in my car and this is like the cute little bag that they put it in well it's really just a brown paper bag with their logo tape to it but um they wrapped it up well she asked me did I want it wrapped up why would I not want it wrapped up like hello but um it looks like i don't know like this is kind of like the finished result and it's like the color scheme is like so different from like when i painted it like the colors are like so much more like vibrant and bright now and low-key it's kind of giving like third grader arts and crafts project <laughs> but it's okay because it was like my first time doing this in so many years so honestly it would have been fine if i didn't have like this um the polka dots on it i don't think i ever showed you guys what it looked like with the polka dots because i stopped filming because i got tired of like filming the whole entire process but um yeah honestly i think it would have looked so much better if i just would have like left the polka dots off because like the color scheme is cute but like the polka dots are just kind of like crazy but i was just trying to be like different and creative so i kind of wanted to like hang this up in my room mm -hmm. I don't know about that anymore but it's okay nonetheless I still had like a really good time doing it like it was very peaceful and freeing and it definitely catered to my inner childhood so I'm definitely gonna do it again sometime soon and like now that I know kind of like how it's gonna turn out I won't add as many like crazy colors I guess because the colors were a lot more dull um before they like put it in the kiln. But now I'm about to go to Five Below because I want to see like what type of decor they have for my room. So that's where we're gonna go. And I just came back from my doctor's office. I had to get some blood draw and I had to um, get some tests ran on me. So that's why I look crazy. <laughs> but we're about to go to Five Below. Hopefully they have some things. So I'm in here right now and I've literally found so much good stuff and I haven't even been here like a full 10 minutes. Like, hello. Like, they're eating today, I swear. Hey guys, so it's been a little bit later and as I'm like editing this video, I realized that like I never really like <laughs> did an outro. After I kind of like picked up my pottery, there wasn't really like much that I did. So I think I just kind of like stopped recording. My birthday is approaching. My birthday's on July 27th. So I don't really think I'm even gonna vlog again until it starts getting closer to that because I kind of want to film like a birthday prep. Normally, I don't really like do enough like prepping for my birthday to even like get content out of it. But 
I don't know. I want to be really cute this year. <laughs> I'm always cute every birthday, but normally I don't really like get my hair done or anything like that. Like I just get my nails done by like a little outfit and call it a day. But I'm actually kind of like doing like enough prep to get like content out of it. So that'll probably be my next vlog. And then, like I said, I'm doing like the redecorate my room type of video, but that's kind of like up in limbo because I'm still not done buying stuff for my room. So I can't upload that yet. Also, ignore my bed. I'm like washing my sheets. That's why it looks crazy back there. But like I always say, if you made it this far, please leave a comment. Give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Thank you.